What is up, YouTube? It is your boy Tish Chris coming back again with another video. And today, as you see by the title, we'll be reacting to Entitled Driver Skips the Line and Gets Instant Karma. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Let's check it out. This video has been blowing up all over TikTok. I've seen a snippet of it. I have not seen the whole thing. Uh, just putting it out there, it was like 30 seconds. That's it. Let's get right into it. Deputies were working a traffic crash when they suddenly encountered a woman who felt she was above the law. Oh boy, that didn't work out too well. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? No! I don't care! The answer's no! Okay. Can you give me your driver's license? Let me. Yes, it is. What? Do you not see this blue truck? Do y'all think the lady wrong? Oh, okay. Well, obviously she's wrong, but she says she gotta go get her daughter. What if her daughter's like one, two years old, can't take her over so? If her daughter like 14, 15, 16, yeah, lady's completely wrong. Do you not see that blue truck? Put your car in park and give me your driver's license. Put your car in park and give me your driver's license. Waiting at the freaking bus stop. I don't. Care. That's your fault. Honestly. We got blue lights and people safety. Yo, why the hell are people so entitled put your nowadays? Car in park. Okay. Stop. Freaking her. idiot. Idiot. Yo, stop. Savage response. Oh, now she finally stops. Get in the car. What is Sit she down. doing? My daughter Sit was right down. here waiting for me. Sit down. Is she drunk? Why is she making it worse? license, registration, and proof of insurance. Because they, went, they blocked it off and I was trying to get to the cell and I got here. She's not freaking it's here. It's related to that. Look, there, my daughter's okay, right Okay, sit down. My daughter's right here. I don't care. He I was doesn't care. My daughter. Dude, it's blocked off. Sit down and give me your driver's license. Now. So that's the thing. Do you not think that people behind you, people in front of you, had other things to do as well? You don't think nobody in front of you had a child? You think you're the first person that wasn't able to see their child because of block traffic? Sit the hell down. What he said. Have it with me. It's at the house. Don't don't get involved. Don't get involved. I get it, but don't get involved. Don't get involved. Get off the I phone. I was trying to. This is my husband. I don't care. I was trying. You to are stopped for a lawful reason. How was it? It wasn't even blocked off. People were coming out of the street. You, you guys were blocking all the way to seventy five. Yeah. Why do you think we're doing daughter. that? There was. It was nothing. Blocking. It was a traffic Wait. crash. Okay. It was you disobeyed. This a, this okay. Way. I'm not arguing with you. Eduardo Garcia. You don't have a driver's license? I have a driver's license. It's at home. That's what I'm trying to say. What's your name? I'm not saying that. Okay. People make it so much worse for themselves. Even if she just did all wrong. Even if she just did all wrong. No cap. She messed up by saying, oh, I'm not saying that. Goodness, my goodness, lady. She it comes back to a nail. Like, if you want my driver's license, okay. okay. You, you want it or you need to take it? So you can take it. All right. Come out. Your kids are in the car, are they? Turn around. This is not the way you should have handled this. Exactly. That was freaking dumb. I sir. I'm trying to get my driver's license. I was trying to get my daughter. And as you see right now, that is a chat GPT person. She is not a real person. Do you have anything in your pockets? Yes. What do you have? I don't know. Yes, I don't know. It's a nice neighborhood, though. Okay. For Florida statute, when we stop you, you have to give us certain documents, and she's refusing. So, unfortunately for her, that's violation, and that's a jailable offense. I don't know. So she probably should have listened to us a mile up the street, and this wouldn't be happening. But she couldn't wait the five seconds it was going to take us to open up the road to come down here, and she came that far from hitting him. 
So now it's aggravated assault on a law enforcement officer, which is a felony. Gosh. You can go. Do you know who owns this car? Yes. Okay, can you call them and have them come pick it up? But that's crazy. Yeah, it's her sister. Is this Jessica? No. No, no, we're not giving her a ticket. No, no, no. Am I able to take the car? If she allows you to take the car, yeah. How are you going to get home? I, I live down the street. Are you going to walk back? Yeah. Okay. If she allows you to take the car, then yeah, we'll let you take the car. Do we have a name? Is her name Jessica? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Are you charge her with the... I, I only saw bits and pieces of it, so what... Obviously, we've got driving around the barricade. Driving around the barricade, and then she drove Oh, God, that was two years ago? But I had to step back before so okay. she wouldn't run me over. Okay. Yeah, so, I'll charge her with it. Yeah. And then I what? Mean, refusing to give information? Oh, she yeah. wouldn't stop until I got up here. I was doing almost 100 just to catch up to her. Damn. Would have taken a lot less time had you just stopped. Then you wouldn't be in this situation. Then gave ID. That doesn't give you the right to almost run over a police officer or I disobey. Okay. So again, why is she being okay. arrested? Let me walk you through this. Please. Okay. Please. There's a massive. Before I before I even interact, do I talk too much? Cause damn. I would think like this would be self-explanatory by this point. Maybe maybe ugh, I don't know. Maybe that lady's just confused. Like the sister right now. I Maybe mean, she's confused, but like, her sister broke the law. Then she didn't want to get no ID. Traffic crash up there, right? We've had to direct traffic for over an hour, hour and a half. We shut the road down legally to get the tow trucks in so we could get the cars off the road in order to open the flow of traffic back up. Do you understand that part? Okay. She decided she didn't want to wait. So we pulled off the road and we opened the entire lane back up. She went in the opposite lane of traffic. And when I stopped her, she decided she didn't want to wait. Right? And I don't know what I'm talking about. So she drives off, almost runs over my foot, doesn't stop for him, and then speeds all the way up Carter Road. And then when he stops her here. Y'all think she takes her side? Whose side do y'all think she takes? Whose side do y'all think she takes? She refuses to get her information. She refuses to say anything other than the fact that I had to go get my daughter. And when we legally stop you for a traffic violation and you refuse to give your stuff, it's a violation of Florida State statute and she went to jail. So that's the only charge right now? Violation of... Mm, no, she's probably going to get a... Uh, we're going to watch the video assault. and if one of us had to step back, she's probably going to get an aggravated assault on law enforcement officer, which is a felony. Had she just waited five more seconds, I was getting in my vehicle and I was pulling off the side of the road. But because she couldn't wait and she went in the opposite lane. Wrong traffic, time, wrong place. She could have caused an accident because the people that, that were coming off of Carter turning right onto Mox and Wallow have the right. At the end of the day, officer, I, I get where they're coming from because that's safety. That is safety. Safety is the number one thing that safety, security, and sanitation, you need all of those. But the officer really has a valid point. The lady drove into opposite side of traffic, right? Imagine like a wreck. The lady's driving the opposite side of traffic. Boom. Coming down. That can easily be another wreck. Lady could get a felony. Another wreck. And that uh, disobeying of whatever. Whatever charge that was. But at the end of the day, I ain't even gonna lie to you. If the person was right, I'll say if the person was right. But this lady was completely in the wrong. All she had to do was wait. She's impatient. But hey, I just hope she gets the help she needs. She's in the opposite lane of traffic. And had she called a traffic crash, a head-on traffic crash, we'd have been towing her off in an ambulance. Exactly. So we don't do things just to piss people off, right? Exactly. We do things for the safety of everybody involved. That's what I just to said. include us, to include the two people that were already involved in the traffic crash. And we don't have time for this, right? Had she just waited and stopped there, and, and I'm pretty easy going, right? So when I ask you to stop, that's what I'm asking you to do. And don't give me this line of excuse. Everybody on that road has somewhere to be. I mean, that's what I said. For a lot of years. When I ask you to stop and get out of the, the opposite lane of traffic, mm -hmm. we have a problem. And then when we come up here, legally we're allowed to ask you for your documents, your driver's license, you're all that. She's refusing. So unfortunately for her, better choices next time. 
But again, we don't. We had a lawful reason to stop that, and because she didn't think that she needed to wait, or that some of the road was opened up to get the, the traffic, the tow trucks in, then yeah. And so, that that's the whole story. The suspect was charged with resisting and cited for disobeying a police officer. She ended up pleading no contest and was sentenced to six months of probation. Consider subscribing to Crime Scene Cam for more exclusive... Yeah, I don't think six months was that bad. I don't think six months was that bad for that. Resisting, obstructing, or opposing an officer without violence. ...content. And check out these next videos. Chat, is one of those a felony? Disobey a police officer. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Just the name of that charge just rubs me the wrong way. The name of that charge just rubs me the wrong way. But anyway, comment down what y'all think below. I hope y'all have a wonderful day. Make sure you check out a couple more of my reaction videos. I think I think the officer had a valid point. It was all safety. Real talk. It was all safety. Whether you like it or not, it was all safety for that lady, for the people. All she had to do was wait a couple more minutes, bruh. If her daughter was already waiting, she's she's been waiting. So just have her wait like four or five more minutes. It's all right. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, to this video. Peace.